Yo, YouTube, what's good, man? It's your boy Proxis, and I'm back with another video. This is my trying to go undefeated. And we're using Demetrius Johnson because I didn't want to use Brandon Moreno again. We're going to get to Henry Cejudo. It looks like this could be somebody on a second account. We're about to find out. Let's see. Uh, maybe, maybe not. Vanch Z228. Now, I do know. Henry Sudo has the Osoto guard trip, but what I need to do in this match is utilize my footwork with Mighty Mouse, all right? And that's what exactly what we're gonna do. Okay, nice shot. Now, Henry Cejudo doesn't have a great switch stance. I don't believe so. He, actually, he may have a good one, but he doesn't have the footwork, and that's when I have to utilize him. There you go. Oh, fake takedown. Are we gonna try to attack his base? See what we can do from there. Mmm, nice. It was a nice timing on the uh, takedown. There you go. Mmm. I'll take that trade. Do three jabs followed by a low kick because I knew all I needed to do was put a little pressure on him. Keep attacking the base. I think that'll be my, not route to victory, but my route to like kind of break this guy down and see exactly what is he doing. And try to open up his defense. I do expect him to possibly shoot some takedowns. Almost. Nice. Didn't do much damage with that low kick. But it did something. <laughs> I gotta remember Demetri Johnson is on that shorter end. So it's gonna be hard for me to land a lot of these low kicks. Nice low kick. Here we go. To the leg. Go back to the leg. Mm. Now just get out of there. Back to the leg. You can see he wants the pressure. I can see that he's starting to get a little bit impatient. I can definitely see that. As he switches stances here. There we go. Nice. Get the rock. Now I'm debating if I want to attack this other leg too, and I probably will. Yeah, you can see, you see how he's so aggressive now? He's being much more aggressive. It's what I want. And also, I got him to switch stance, so he really can't do those sort of guard trip if he does uh, stay in the southpaw stance. Okay, here we go. Round two. I'm gonna go back to trying to attack his base. Nice, that was really good for him. I don't want my head health getting really low. See how he switched stance? Nice combo by him. I'm not really tripping about that. I'm actually doing some really good work. Like that right there. You don't got to get off that leg, boss man. There you go. See if we can get. Mm. Okay, we got the knockdown, so I'll take it. Back to the leg. Gotta watch out for the high kick, cause he's been 
He's been attacking. That's a lit. That's a lit. He's been attacking like the body with the roundhouse. That's a lit. Mm. And I gotta watch out for him possibly going up top with the. This guy's good, but I do see he's a bit impatient. Okay, let me not throw combos like that. Just keep attacking his base. Here we go. Take the calf kick. You can see I'm kind of building my uh, advantage here. And I built it by attacking his legs. Nice low kick. I got the knock. Oh, that was a good jab. I'll take that. I'll take it. Back to the leg. Nice. That was nice by him, but he kind of used a lot of stamina to land like two punches. Back to the leg. Back to the leg. And you can see how he's kind of going crazy with his strikes. I'm a little bit more calculated. But we're able to chop his legs down, so that's a plus. Got him. See how aggressive he was? It's gonna get tired. Here we go. I believe this is round three. Stamina's good. He's trying to set us up for that high kick, by the way. He's trying to set us up for that jab cross high kick. He's been attacking the body after the cross. They go jab cross in the roundhouse to the body. There we go. Little knockdown. Back to the leg. Back to the leg. There we go. Call him. Mm. You just got to be. There he goes. Nice check. Get the rock again. Get the knockdown. There you go. And you can see here the fight's starting to get much harder for him. See if we can take his back and do some work on the ground. We're going to be looking to be heavily, heavily, not defensive, but I, I want to make him work on the, on the ground. I don't want to give him too many opportunities to do anything. We've done, we've done the work on the feet. Now let's see what we can do to him on the ground. There we go, we get tied title. Okay. Oh, he just gave his back mount. Now with top mount. Let's posture up, rain down a couple strikes. To the right. And this is just me using like a because right now he's kind of desperate on the feet. And don't get me wrong, he can still win on the ground here. But his stamina is much lower on the ground than it is. Then, like, what am I trying to say? His stamina, his effectiveness of his stamina is not going to be that great on the ground. First, it's on the feet. He can throw a jab cross high kick and my block is gone. It can get me out of there. So right now, I'm just working on the ground, being patient. Here we go, get the denial. I think we'll be able to. Let me side saddle. Since he keeps faking, I'll go with actual transition. Let's posture up. Oh. He goes back up to the feet. Now I'm gonna just throw a knee to the head. I'm gonna just see what he's gonna do. I'll let the, I'll let the round ride out to the next one. I'm not gonna throw any like crazy strikes. 
Maybe some filler shots like the jab. Maybe check him with the low kicks. Oh, my cross landed actually rocked him. There you go. Good round. Respect for sure. But yeah, this is, I think this is 100% somebody on the second account. Nobody's level 27 and already Division 20, basically. Nice. My block is gone. Back to the leg. You can see how aggressive he is. You do see he's trying to throw low kick. That goes to high kick. And as I said before, man, we want to utilize our footwork. Demetri Johnson is a very hard man to catch. And a lot of people use Demetri Johnson, and they'll be super aggressive. You don't realize, but you can really play footsies with people, and they can't hit you. Then he got really good hand speed. Keep attacking his leg. There goes the jab cross high kick that I was talking about. That's exactly what I was talking about. It don't take much, man. That jab cross high kick will get me going. <clears throat> get another knockdown. Try to take him down. Another knockdown. Go for the ground and pound. I actually, oh man. Boom, another knockdown. Now, I'm gonna tell you why I'm not really jumping on him. It's because I want the ground and pound animation where he can't really do much out of it. Not that one, not the full guard ground and pound. Jeez. Look at my head off. Look at my head off. He has a chance. I think it's knocked down again. Back to the leg. Good night. This is a good one. This was a good one. Respect to him. Respect to him. But, hey. We was able to utilize our game plan, what we wanted to do with attacking the base. And from there, we was able to open up his defense and really get the, uh, a really clean win clean here. But I'm pretty sure some of you guys were looking at the beginning of the fight and was thinking, oh, yeah, this is this is the end of prize run. But it's not, man. It is not. We're still here and uh, still undefeated, right? But I do want to check the staff. We have seven knockdowns. Six rocks, seven knockdowns, 30, 27. Round one, they gave it to us. Round two, they gave it to us, of course, with the knockdown. Round three, of course, we got two knockdowns. Then round four, it just started getting ugly. This probably would have been a 10-8 round for sure, but I'm going to get out of here. I hope you guys enjoyed this one here. The streak continues. And actually, let's check what, like, what's our ranking. And let me see, let me see. Our ranking and where we're on leaderboards. We're number 442. We're 23 and 0. We actually just fought the guy that was right here. Well, he was probably up a little bit more, but this is the guy we just fought. So, all in all, GG's, man. But I'm out of here. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, hit the like button. And uh, I'll catch y'all in the next one.